Hello, this is Grandpa's Gone Gaming. I am bringing you episode two of the Minecraft Hardcore Challenge for June 2019 by Michael Deering. We are doing the Rift Island House Challenge, and I stopped on my way there. I guess I could rescue some of these. I'm not going to go down and get them from down there, but I think since I'm still back in the beginning here and I'm not coming back this way that I will do that. So I have um, flint there, plenty of cobblestone. Wait, there was a you know, skeleton and creeper out here that blew things up over that way. Alright, so I still want to go towards negative X and positive Z. Right that way. Right there. To the southwest. Alright, here we go. Do some zigzagging around here. Oh, that's where I filled in. I think, no, it wasn't either. All right, oh, man. Oh, oh, oh. There's skeleton. That's probably what I was hearing while I was down there. I think I just saw a creeper. I hear something. It's not a creeper. Zombie. Sheep. Sheep won't do me any good, and I'm hanging on to a stick. <laughs> okay, let's uh, let's do this, then. Do we still need to need to go need to need do we need to need to go more this way? Um I'm going towards positive one eighty four, so this will still be good going this way. Alright. Whoa. Um Oh, there's a planes over there. Okay, so I guess let's get this out of my hand. Um, if I'm going to have anything in my hand at all, I'd rather have an axe. Boom! Alright, I still need to go both directions, so that's okay. Um, doing alright here. That's a little faster this way anyway. Wow, that was a bigger jump than I expected. Uh, more dark forest over there, so... Okay, that does look to be the direction we need to go. How about if we, um, this looks like a little bit smaller tree here. Let's do this. Get some more wood. Oh, I shouldn't do that. should not stand on top of these because they can be taller than you think, and there are the other parts like those. Oh, okay, there we go. We're fine. so much easier coming down the tree than going up. Blue flowers. Also, oh, there's a big hole in the ground right there. Okay. Let me take a look at that. Um, it's a water hole. Okay, so yeah, we're still going this direction then. Alrighty. I might want to take some of that. Could come in handy. Maybe we'll see some pumpkins. That'll be a little change in diet at least. Man, there are cattle everywhere. Um, oh, hey, yeah, there's some more of the sugar cane right over here. Wow, oh, lots of it. Very cool. This is not, the, no, that's not really an island. But for a minute there I thought, oh no. But I didn't take down a tree, so I'm okay. Anyway. Uh, ooh, there's more coal. There is, yeah, there's more coal. I have some. I don't know if I want to go down there, though. Let's not. Let's just get where we're going. Okay, so we're at minus 240. So we're about 200 blocks away. And about 40 blocks away on the Z. So we are getting closer. Ah. Uh, big hole in the ground and water oh look at that one of those water standing on the edge things not standing on edge but <laughs> um, okay minus 319 to minus 320 so okay but we're right in line now so this one is that it over there minus 476 okay that looks like that might be that doesn't look like an island but maybe it is. We'll go see. I see pigs. Oh yeah, that's got to be it. Okay, one 
84. Oh, okay, I see. There's. I was expecting an ocean. Wow. Okay, it's not an ocean. Let's grab some of this sand. That way we won't take any off of our little island. We'll just take it off of here. And we are here late enough now in the day that we need to do some lighting up, I think. And uh, make sure that we're safe over here. Hmm. Um, I wasn't thinking of... Yeah, it's definitely a river. It goes over that way and that way. So it must be on the other side also. I wasn't thinking of River Island. Wow. I just assumed that we were going to be on an ocean. Huh. How much do I have? 35. Let's go ahead and get some more. Okay. Alright, let's... We have some torches. And we can make more. We have coal. We have trees. And we can get plenty of other trees, obviously. That's not going to be a problem. I want to see what the other side of this looks like. Okay, I see. It's definitely an island. Huh. Interesting. Good call, Michael. It looks to me like this could be become quite a nice little home. Alright, let's um, start. I'm going to take how much? Yeah, I have room. Room, room. I have room for this. I'm going to take this out. This is not a dark oak. So I'm going to get the little tree out of here. Then we'll have wood for other things that we um, don't need for building. Take out these oak leaves. If I get some shears, then I can I can reconfigure the other trees too, as long as I don't don't uh, cut them down. I like making tree houses, that's fun. But this, I'm thinking, hmm, I'm not really sure what I'm thinking because it wasn't what I'm, really isn't what I was expecting at all. Um, it is a nice little island. Okay, um, let's do some of this here. I want to make sure I save some of the dark oak in logs because then I can extend the uh, bottoms of these trees and all that kind of stuff. See, this is dark oak. What else do I have? I, light. I, I need to put some lights in. Oh, this is going to bug me if I don't do something about it. Yeah, like right there. I'll take the dirt out from underneath that one and put... I'll extend the tree. I won't cut it down. I'll make it bigger. Okay, right here. We'll take those. Not removing a tree, guys. I'm just taking that out, and then I'm going to use this. And make this tree just a little taller. Just the opposite of taking it down. Okay. The, the dark oaks lend themselves to that very nicely because they're already, um, you know, off balance, so to speak, from the extra overhang stuff that they have. All right, let's take this out of here. Ooh, that's uh, andesite. There's a lot of that, it looks like. Okay, I can use that. I think what I'm going to do, though, right now is just stick a torch down in here. And then I'll come back up. I do need to make another shovel before I do any more of that. But let's get some light going. Because it's going to be dark here. And I would really not rather have to have stuff spawning right on top of me. Okay. Take that one out. Okay. Okay, we'll put that one right there. <laughs> How many do I have left? Okay, we still have a few. And I need to eat. Ooh, pretty moon. Let's get food down here instead of an empty bowl. Okay. Um. And that one there. 
Better go this way. No, oh, I don't have another shovel. Now my son-in-law wouldn't care. He doesn't use shovels. Unless he's making a path. He hasn't played in a while. He, he doesn't care for 1.13 and hasn't even tried 1.14. He likes the way his fishing pole worked before. So, um, yeah, he's not been real happy with having 1.13 be different than what he had before. He'll probably get back up one of these days. He's kind of going back to playing Guild Wars 2 right now. I almost walked right in there. Yeah, I think that would probably make a good basement part there. Let's uh, kill a zombie, and I got the wrong thing in my hand. I didn't make a sword. I did not. That's right. Uh, he'll probably just become drowned. Nope, he's going to come on up. <coughs> <coughs> That should be extra food. Okay, let's see what we have going here now. Get some more down here. I do have some... Oh, that's a squid, I guess. <laughs> Startled me after having one creeper go off right in my face almost. Uh, actually, I don't think there was almost about it. Okay, let's put that one right here, that'll do, there, keep an eye out here, okay that's good, oops, now I need to make some more torches, don't have a lot of coal, uh, I do have sticks though, where'd they go? Okay. Go up here. Probably just stop and make a shovel. Okay, is that an oak tree? Or yeah it is. Okay, we can fill this in. Also. Probably just these two. What did I just hear? Creeper. Water. Ay, 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 ay. Do not blow up my island. I just got through placing all those torches. Come on out here and blow up. Or be killed, one or the other. I don't care which. Don't really need gunpowder for anything. Unless I want to make a music box. Oops. Alright. Um, no, music box. It's not. That's redstone, isn't it? It's TNT that you put into... Oh, I don't know. That sounded funny also. <sighs> I feel very much alone out here. All right, where... I think that... Yeah, that's oak. Regular oak. Get this out of the way. Place them once I get some shears. Alright, let's try to make sure we don't get any more creepers. Two already in the game is more than enough. Oops. Okay, so that's there. Okay, let's put this one up here. Uh, I could 
take that off too. That one there. That's good. There. Is that right? Yep. I need another block down there. Oops. Ooh, concentrating here, sorry. Also have kind of a little bit of a headache. It was a kind of a long day. Really good day. Really good day, but kind of long. Very busy. Got to be outside, enjoying the sunshine. It was about 76 degrees during the daytime. What a difference from what it has been. Beautiful. We went out, we went and got some tomato plants and some pepper plants. And a couple of, uh, my husband wanted some geraniums to put near the garden too. And we just had a really, really good time. We went and had lots some lunch. Took it over to the lake. Sat there and watched. Uh, there were people swimming actually. The, the lake temperature has already come up to over 70 degrees. We know because David went and tested it because he's been waiting for that to happen so he could go fishing for his northern pike that he loves to fish for. There's one more of those there. Okay. And we were going to get the parking permit for the park. It's the a state park, a South Dakota State Park. It's uh, my sister's lake house is up there just above the, the little resort, which is on private land. And uh, so, yeah, it, that's we've I've been back and forth there all my life, and we lived there for a while in that cabin. Let's take that gravel. Where'd it go? Gravel. Oh, okay. Um, anyway, so then we talked to the ranger that was on duty there. Not, well, he's a park attendant. Um, but we couldn't pay for the uh, parking permit today because they don't uh, take fees on Wednesday. Because <laughs> they have uh, an audit every Wednesday. So. He, um, he could have taken cash if David had had cash, but he didn't have cash. He was going to put it on his debit card, so that didn't work. But the guy gave us a um, one-day pass to get in. <laughs> He's a friend. Been a friend for years now, since we moved back over this way. Well, David had never been here before, but... Um, well, he came with me once. Hey, a drowned is making himself known over there. But yeah, this is this is kind of home territory for me over here in South Dakota. I sp I I went to school here a little bit when I was growing up. There's another zombie. Are we at? Uh, not at day two yet. We're getting there though. Oh, he has a shovel. Do you think he'd give that to me? Do I? Yeah, I do have still. He's. How about if you give me that shovel? I could use that. I probably won't. But it's worth a try, right? That drown's getting a little too close for my comfort. He did not. But he gave me some, some flesh. That guy hit me hard. I came down, I came down at him at the wrong angle. Okay, we will, whoa, what am I getting hit with? An arrow, I suppose? Let me get out of the way. I'm not sure what I got hit with. I don't know. Oh, yep, skeleton over there, over here. All right, I'll be back with episode three. Thanks for watching, and bye for now.